everybody. Welcome to the Youth Services Book Chat at the Amherst Public Library. And I think now that we're approaching mid-January, we can definitely talk about winter. We have a couple winter books that I brought today. So the one is called When Winter Comes. And this is by Amy Bissonette. And this has really neat pictures about all the things that happen in the woods when it's winter time. Discovering wildlife in our snowy woods. When winter comes, isn't it fun to look at pictures like this, the swirling snow, and all of a sudden you can make things out of it. It's just like in the summertime when you see the puffy clouds. You try and find an animal in there. When winter comes, and deep snow blankets the woods, and ice forms cold and smooth on the lakes, thick enough for us to skate on. Some people think our woods are empty, but, we know better. And if you want to find out how we know, come look at all these pictures and read all the words about what happens in the wintertime. All the different things that happen underneath the blanket of snow. Come check out When Winter Comes. It's Discovering Wildlife in Our Snowy Woods by Amy Missinette. And that I found this fun one called Once Upon a Winter Day. Have you ever tried making up a story all by yourself? Well, you can do that this book. This is by Eliza Woodruff and she shows some of the cool prints that are in the winter time snow. Look at that. Milo bundled up and plotted outside. He didn't want to play in the snow. He wanted a story and so he made it up with his adventure. Yes. He stomped a path from the house to the bird feeder. Beneath the feeder, tiny prints were sprinkled around the ground. Bet a mouse was here, he thought. And then the story takes off, as did the mouse. Come take out this book, Once Upon a Winter Day by Liza Woodruff. And you know how when you're in the winter blues and you want to get something going? How about getting your body going? with Go Noodle. This is the best of Go Noodle. These songs are great, and if they don't get you moving, nothing will. Gotta have fun in the wintertime and keep active. That's what this will help you do. So come check out Best of Go Noodle and play those fun songs. And if you're really looking for something special to do, ask your parents or grown-ups, what about a soup kitchen? There's so many around our county in Lorraine, and this is a cool way to find out what it's all about. This is called Our Little Kitchen. It's by Jillian Tamaki, and it tells how the soup kitchen works. I just thought it was such a clever written book. And this is what happens when they come into the soup kitchen. This is mom and the little boy. And then they visit the people that run the soup kitchen. And it talks about how they all pitch in to make things all come together so that people can be fed that maybe not have a good meal sometimes if it weren't for the soup kitchen. So come check out our little kitchen and find out all the pleasant little treasures that a garden can help bring to other people by Jillian Tamaki. Well, it's been good seeing you. Come see us at the Amherst Public Library. Bye now.